Hello and welcome back to Neubrunn. Um, let's see the state of the fields. Okay, I think one needs to be seated. Yep. So we don't. Ooh, yes, the more horses, more horses. Um. Let me see if I can turn this volume down. Um, uh, sound. Let's see if that works. Nice. Okay. So we need to get our brand new tractor back on home. Oh, and I kind of modified my steering wheel. I made it smaller. We'll go this way around the light pole. And I just kind of, when I made it smaller, I just kind of took a smaller lid that I have. Oh, it needs to be harvested. I thought it needed to be plowed. Or is that the field over here? Um, do we have... Cool, we do. Okay, well. Let's get this field harvested then. Um... I just took a smaller lid to my bigger steering wheel that I had and traced a smaller circle, cut it out, and the big ring that I had left ended up doing some uh, bigger grips so that way I have a better grip on the steering wheel it's actually more comfortable so we'll do that so that way we can do this now I love the stopping power of these things whoops how about we get this uh, lined up a little more properly instead of going about three miles down the road to back up? Where am I going? There we go. Got it. And tonight is. I was gonna, I was gonna introduce tonight as being the Fourth of July, but it is now Fifth of July. It's getting on one o'clock in the morning. Um, you know what? We can park you actually right there. Um. I believe this is the only tractor we have. Yes. Okay. Um.
This is sorghum, and I cannot remember if the chickens eat sorghum. So, oh, you're not even uh, started there yet, bro. Hell, you know what this means. Let's wait for the harvester to go by first off. seed. You can buy seeds, herbicide, fertilizer, in this tank. Okay, cool. Guess what? Now how in the world are we supposed to actually... No, no, no. Get it, get it. Come on. There we go. Okay, where is the actual... I can't see how much it took because of the little recorder icon and the time is in the way. But I did see a three. And I am currently in, also in the process of uploading Hagenstead. Needs plowing, there's nothing in there. Okay, this was the field I was looking at. So. But yeah, 20 different subjects at once here. Um... Do I want, what do I want to put in here? Um, yes, there's people still letting off fireworks. Um, technically here in the U.S. it's July 5th, uh, Wednesday. But technically, I have, like I said, most people haven't gone to bed so they don't consider it to be the next day yet until they actually wake up. So some people are still celebrating the 4th of July. Happy 4th of July anyway, I don't care. This is, I was wanting to send out a good 4th of July to everybody. So, if you're watching this video, happy 4th of July, even though it may be late, you know, a day late. But, um, hmm. I think we can start putting wheat in here, you know, so we can start stocking up on our wheat, getting it off to the, uh, grain mill and ooh that was a bright one and I got my shades closed alright um, I'm going to take over here This field is going to fit into this harvester. And we'll 
what I want to do. is look up to see number one how many horsepower this thing is if it even I can't remember if it shows or not but to also see if I can uh, afford to get the next size up header and if this would even run it um, Ooh, something else I wanted to point out to you guys. That, uh, I was watching Omatana. And she had, was going around, uh, whatever map she was on. I can't remember. But it was in 23 here. And I think it was Amberstone. Because I think she speaks her native language in Neubrunn. You know, which is cool. Because I always say, don't forget where you came from. Um, but she was tooling around town here and she come across the sheep pen. It is the same price... as the grain mill which is ninety six thousand dollars so I think my son has some friends over and I think they're playing music and uh, here comes shortly I'm going to have to tell him to keep it down and because I'm recording um, because I am not having I don't have music in this video. I don't want to get a copyright because people want to play music. It's like I said, it's either coming from upstairs or outside here and no one listens anyway, so they don't care. So I'm hoping like crazy the music doesn't really affect anything so oh it does a little tight turn there buddy and also when we get done with this field there's something I want to check on too <laughs> you guys should have heard these fireworks going off earlier sound like a freaking tank shooting its gun off alright we have this field done we have the trailer somewhere, I think it's right there. Let's get your pipe out before I go in any further. But yeah, Omatana said that the sheep and the sheep pen and the grain mill was the same price. And even the same price, pretty much the uh, 
prices that are here in Neubrunn are the same in Amberstone. So, cool, I guess. There's just a lot of people that wish they can uh, actually have a shed. Okay, we'll park you there. And we'll let you go because I want to look in the store. Harvesters. We have the first one here, obviously. Uh, Deutz far, but they, they're not bad harvesters. Okay, 310 pounds. Or, yeah, 310 horsepower. Excuse me. Uh, let's see, that's a six meter. Why does it not say the horsepower recommended? What did this say? Six meter. This is a seven and a half. Forty eight thousand. And we have fifty three. And if we sell this, I don't know if it's depreciated or not, but it can, it can take some of the, uh, it can take a chunk of change off of that one. Um, okay. Um, okay, let's ride with him for a minute. And like my jobs, I really didn't like, I don't like every, anything overlapping because I want time in between. But please excuse me. Uh, um, you can tell this AI worker what to do, but I got to finish up the uh, upload on the uh, on my Hagenstead video it's only going to take me like one to two minutes because all I got to do is just click I got to do like five clicks I'll be right back and I'm pretty sure there's that Bring in the spring from the last. Do that. Nations. Set it to public. Publish. Pull that out of here. All right, awesome. Hagenstead is now live and ready for your viewing. So please watch. Um, and like I said, if you don't like it, if you're going to hit the dislike, okay, there are things you're going to like, there are things you're going to dislike. But if you're going to hit the dislike, um, Please let me know what it is that you disliked so I can be sure not to do it again or something that I can improve on. That would be much appreciated. Though I think sometimes it's the work I do, you know, repetitive kind of thing if you will, or the music I use. Um many people may not like that but you know my apologies I was born with a rock and roll soul alright let me stop this yahoo get that going cause Hmm. 
Let's go forward there. Okay, where is it at? Where is it at? Where is it at? I think it's there. Is it there? Whoops, wrong direction. Yep, coolness. Alright guys, sorry about that. But yeah, I don't know how many times I wished y'all a happy 4th of July already between this video and, um, oh, maybe a couple videos back. Uh, Bear Rock, I think, I'm guessing. But yes, happy 4th of July. You know, have fun. The time spent with the family, friends, if they wasn't doing anything. Get back over there. Come on. Oh, hey, that works too. Drive halfway down the field before... Oh, come on. I'm backing up halfway down the street. Yeah, I knew this would happen. The minute I tell you guys I'm actually getting better at playing on mobile again, I start screwing up. Well, oh, that would have been a perfect line, but I already went down that way. Yeah, because we got sorghum in the trailer, and I can still take that over to the grain, to the grain mill. Whoops, I need to get my foot off a of reverse gear here, too. Well, we'll get this field done. And then we'll come back and grab the sliver.
I'm not actually sure if we got it or not, but anyways. Well, after we get this field done, we'll go and take that trailer over to the grain mill. Oh, oh, oh. Also, to come to find out, come to find out. Yes, a lot of you heard of having uh, their uh, collectibles. And I think there's 10 in each map. So, there are uh, different, like, there are different animals, uh, the implements, the tractors, you know, things like that. They're huge, because if you're playing on a map like on uh, FS22, you know how small the collectibles are, right? Yeah, 20 times that size. I mean, still not as big as Scooby-Doo, but they're big. And I'm leaving a sliver again. The blazes. Anyway. Oh, and if you hear anything squeaky or clicky or whatever, I made my steering wheel out of cardboard and duct tape, and believe it or not, the steering axle is a, the steering column is a knitting needle. The, the squeaky rubby is the the tape rubbing on one another so and I think in there is like a some of the parts in the back there are catching because this is not for one this is not like not really stable not stiff and I have not figured out a way to prevent that yet so Get out of the tree. Oh, wow. Okay, third. We're going to have, okay, 29 minutes and so far. And I don't think I've done a, any uh, jump cuts yet. Actually, I don't think I will. Um, just kind of play this like I do my time lapses just straight through what you see is what you get I mean unless I'm doing like a real super huge job then I might actually shut up long enough to do a jump cut but Hey, 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 back up, back up, back up. 
Well, I think I saw a dagger one, you know, do a run through. And he's like, well, I wonder if we can go into the water. He tries it. There's like an invisible fence or something like that blocking you. So you can't go into the water. So. That's good. It'll help stop the runaway AI workers. I'll tell you what, this shrinking the steering wheel seems to help a little better. I just got to get the throttle and the... Uh, can I have you lined up? There we go, thank you. I just got to get the brake and the throttle, uh, throttle a little better in tune with it too. Okay, $204 in wages. Yeah, so that was when we had the worker. And I think two more passes and we're good. But too bad there's not like an actual brake pedal. And what FS was it, 14 or 16 for mobile? You had the gas pedal and you had the slide bar for the steering. One more pass and we can go sell the sorghum. We'll go see how much that brings us in. And there's a section of that field that's not going to get seeded, I don't think. But what else is new? Alright, let's... Get this doohickey back to the farm. And we might actually walk around our... I want to park you over here. Yeah. I'm talking booms like that. So. Actually, let's take a little drive around. Is there anything there? No? Okay. We'll start with the hometown or home, uh, home farm first to see if there's actually anything. Because like I said, it, these are huge, so there is like no missing them. I just want to see if there's any in the yard. Um, yeah, if this is one, yes. Okay, you see how big this thing is? Uh, 
and that's how big my house is okay now you're seeing this right that's how big these collectibles are in here there's ten of them and you get a grand each so that was one and if this is the map Oh, wait a minute, this, this is not Amberstone. Um, Grain Mill South and Amberstone had one. Oh, well, you know what? We need to go sell some... Crash right into the fence. Is it this side? Nope, the other side. As I run it over, or run into it, will you stop going like 4,000 feet out of the way? Okay, um... Feeding grain north, feeding grain south. Ooh, okay, well. What are the prices like? Did I say this was... Oh, I was calling it uh, sorghum. This is canola. My bad. Uh, oil mills got 2135 which is a dollar more than what the feeding grain north is so we can go to the uh, oil mill all right and on our way Oh, nice little town. Whoops! Wild ride. I should take my foot off the gas next time. Well, thumb off the gas. Um, okay, yeah, we could do this.
Well, no kidding there, Jack. Um, I think I was supposed to stay on the road. And I could probably do another little treasure hunt map if you guys would like. Are we out of the camp? Alright, let's... Too bad we can't run. But I wonder how much it is to actually buy... this oil mill here. Okay, there's nothing here. Yep. There's another one. And I did not see how much we made from the grain or from the canola. But I do want to see how much it is to buy this oil factory. I know it's going to be almost an hour of no editing and how much? Ooh, eighty thousand. Nice, but we can't afford it just yet. So, then we just have like sixty four thousand dollars you know I haven't I want to do another treasure hunt map because I haven't done one in a bit so I'll do a, I got three game save slots here. I can just go around and uh, look for them. And at least show you guys on the map which would be a lot easier to do because this is on mobile and the map ain't you know super huge you guys can see where the you know where I'm at and I'll be in the location and you guys can um, you know see or get the idea of a general location whatever so yeah I want to do that I want to do another treasure hunt because I got bare rock logging and I think two sections and I got hinterland as well so Oh, you know what's going to happen here? We are going to park you 
right there. And we're going to exit. Okay, yeah. I don't know if you guys could actually see the time or not, but it's like 46 minutes. Um, we have the canola field that's behind us to our left. Harvested and sold. Right over there. You know what would have been more smart of me is to check the silo to see if we had any canola in there or not. We have wheat planted in this field over there. Now we have this field here and the old canola field there to excuse me, on counter plus one um, to uh, cultivate and reseed and we'll do that in the next video and hopefully it's not this long um, I do want to try to save up to get uh, sheep or the grain mill but I don't know we just saw the price of the oil mill was only 80000 so um, who knows maybe we get $80,000 I'll buy the, the oil mill instead sorry I drink a coffee but anyways I'm going to leave it here and we'll stare at our hundred and thirty one thousand dollar forge wagon I guess I don't know why it's so freaking expensive maybe ninety to a hundred and five thousand I could see that but not a hundred thirty one anyways y'all take care I'm out peace